2024 is barely past the halfway mark, and all that most avid Nissan followers can think of is, what's next? What models has Nissan lined up for the future? Today, our focus is on 2026 and though most people wouldn't have guessed it, Nissan has always lined up a few models and the roster couldn't have been more exciting. According to various reports, Nissan plans to unveil at least 30 new models by 2026, of which 16 are expected to be electrified and the other 14 to feature an internal combustion engine. Moreover, 7 out of the 30 models will target the North American market, more so the United States. There are also suggestions that Nissan plans to invest at least 200 million US dollars into its car production in the US, which will see it increase its production output by a massive margin by 2026. This is what Nissan CEO Makoto Uchida had to say about the automaker's plan to expand its lineup soon. It illustrates our continuous progression and ability to navigate changing market conditions. Mr. Makoto will then go ahead and assert, this plan will enable us to go farther and faster in driving value and competitiveness. Thanks to the extreme market volatility, Nissan is taking decisive actions guided by the new plan to ensure sustainable growth and stability. Live up to its vow, Nissan has already kick-started production for some of these models and today we shall explore the best five. Watch out for number one. In number five, 2026 Nissan Maxima. The current Nissan Maxima is on its last trial and we expect the manufacturer to wrap production this year and kick-start production for the next generation year. So, we should see a new 9th generation for this legendary 5 passenger sedan in 2026. While we don't expect a complete overhaul, many things will change. For example, we expect Nissan to adopt a new door design, an upgraded powertrain, and a sharper exterior. According to currentdriver.com, we shall look at an elevated sports sedan, another way to describe the perfect marriage between a luxury sedan and a modern sports car. If that turns out to be true, then we aren't just looking at better looks but also an improvement in comfort and speed. Postwise, currentdriver.com projects a starting price of $44,000 for the entry-level Maxima Engage trim and $61,000 for the top-tier Maxima Platinum. Of course, we expect Nissan to include a few trims in between, such as the current Venture Plus, Evolve Plus and Empower Plus. Nonetheless, we foresee a situation in which Nissan offers a smaller battery capacity on the entry-level Nissan Maxima to help reduce its base price and make it more affordable. Concerning the platform, we expect the 2026 Nissan Maxima to ride on Nissan's newest CMF EV underpinning, which is a collaborative effort between Mitsubishi and Renault. Mark you, this is also the same underpinning on the Nissan Ariya electric SUV. Suppose Nissan decides to go the Ariya route. In that case, we can also expect the 2026 Nissan Maxima entry-level variant to at least feature a single electric motor on its front axle with a power delivery of 214 horsepower and a top value of 221 pound-feet. However, we can expect the top-tier all-wheel drive to churn up to 389 horsepower, as in the case of the Ariel. CurrentDriver.com suggests the possibility of 483 horsepower and a torque of 519 pound-feet, which will be phenomenal. We can only wait to see if the projections will turn out true. In number 4, 2026 Nissan Leaf. Plans are underway for Nissan to unveil the third generation of its pioneering EV, the Nissan LEAF. With a new generation comes considerable design changes. If the rumors are true, we could see a different Nissan LEAF in 2026. One change is on its exterior, where we expect Nissan to ditch the traditional hatchback style and settle on something slicker and more high-riding. We can see Nissan drawing inspiration from its latest Aria model which I touched on before. 
And just like the Aria, the 2026 Nissan Leaf will have a more aerodynamic look. This evolution should make it quicker than its predecessor. However, the design changes are not the only changes we expect to see on the new Nissan Leaf. We equally expect changes in its configuration and drive range. Starting with the configuration, we expect the 2026 Nissan Leaf to ride on the new CMF EV platform, which you find not only on the Nissan Aria but also on the Renault Megane. Overall, that will mean better fuel economy for the 2026 Nissan Leaf. That's not all. The CMF EV platform integrates better with advanced EV systems and technologies, significantly improving the driving range. Judging by the Nissan Arias and Renault Megane's most recent performance, we can expect the Leaf's drive range to improve by up to 20. We can expect the Leaf's drive range to improve by 25%. Moreover, thanks to the impressive new Envision battery, we expect the Leaf's battery to last up to 480 kilometers or about 298 miles per single charge. Overall, if the 2026 Nissan Leaf can adopt the appealing SUV design, incorporate the advanced Envision battery, and ride on the new CMF AV platform we expect it to ride on, we surely can expect it to ultimately reclaim the position it once held as a kingpin electric SUV. Only then can we affirm that Nissan has done this revolutionary SUV justice. Wait a minute. I know you're enjoying this video. What about you give me a thumbs up by liking it, then subscribe and hit that notification bell to stay informed on our latest epic videos. Let's continue. In number 3, 2026 Nissan Armada The Nissan Armada is an absolute darling for those seeking a roomier option than the Nissan Pathfinder. However, it offers an almost similar drive experience and amenities. This full-size SUV currently holds the title of Nissan's biggest SUV, capable of accommodating up to 8 passengers. The 2026 Nissan Armada should offer the same capacity as the current model and we expect that it will even be roomier and cozier. Speaking of spaciousness, we expect captain chairs to occupy the second row instead of the regular bench style seat that will allow you to easily fold them when accessing the rear end. Another significant interior update expected concerns the infotainment system, which we hope will feature a larger multimedia touch screen of at least 12.3 inches and an advanced Bose audio system with at least 13 speakers. The touch screen interface will be more intuitive and offer brighter icons. And of course, we expect standard infotainment features like Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, Sirius XM Satellite Radio. The Nissan Armada is in its second generation dating back to 2017. Nissan has not confirmed that it will unveil the 2026 version as a third generation. So we cannot expect many changes from the existing edition. However, we expect some minor refinements and upgrades as we've highlighted. We expect Nissan to make a few changes to the driver assistance suit to make it more reliable and capable. In that case, we can hope for better versions of the automated emergency braking system, blind spot monitoring system, lane departure warning system, and lane departure alert system. In number 2, 2026 Nissan Xterra. Imagine a world where the legendary Toyota 4Runner is taken down in its porch of road. Apparently, this may no longer be fantasy but reality if the 2026 Nissan Xterra materializes. For a long time, Nissan has craved for an authentic off-roader. At least Toyota can claim to have the 4Runner. Jeep boasts of the Wrangler, the Ford takes pride in both the Bronco and Explorer. Yes. Nissan has had the Pathfinder, but it has not even been able to take down the Forerunner. But now, the manufacturer has the Xterra, which we only expected to get better in 2026. At one point, the Nissan Xterra was a forgotten memory exiting the market in 2015. Nissan even introduced the ROG, which I'll be talking about later as its successor. 
and everyone thought that was it for the Xterra. But now, we expect this legendary off-roader to make a comeback in 2026 in what will be a third generation. So, what can we expect from the 2026 Nissan Xterra? We've got to start with a standard 4-liter V6 engine which delivers 261 horsepower and 281 pound-feet of torque. This engine will be paired with a 6-gear manual transmission and available in front-wheel and all-wheel configurations. That's fantastic news when looking to conquer the off-road. But still, we expect Nissan to offer a few optional choices, one of which is a 2.3-liter turbocharged engine similar to what you find on the newest Nissan Navara. If that's the case, we can expect this engine to churn out at least 190 horsepower and register a torque value of 332 pound-feet. We also can't rule out the possibility of a naturally aspirated 2.5-litre four-cylinder. We can project that the latter will be directed towards the Chinese market, available in diesel or gasoline options, and featuring a standard six-speed manual gearbox. In number one, 2026 Nissan Draug. I mentioned the Nissan Draug as the SUV that was supposed to replace the Nissan Xterra. But from what we can tell, the Xterra's renaissance is imminent and likely to happen in 2026. That means the ROG will have to curve its trajectory, which we can argue it has already done, having been in production for a decade. Currently on its third generation, which kicked off in 2020 and was refreshed in 2023, we can only expect the ROG to improve. We expect the crossover, which most of us recognize as the Nissan X-Trail, to continue being Nissan's best-selling model. Overall, we see the 2026 Nissan Rogue continue its incredible run. For one, we expect the newly introduced Rogue Rock Creek to headline 2026. When it does, it will undeniably be everyone's darling, especially those seeing an all-terrain absolute best. Forget the Nissan Xterra, the Rogue Rock Creek is the real deal. This off-road marvel is designed to conquer the most challenging terrains. If we were to compare it with anything, it will likely rival the Forerunner, RAV4 TRD off-road and Tucson XRT. It sets itself apart from the other Rogue editions in appearance and performance. If I were to touch on its appearance for a second, the Rogue swales are perfectly wrapped in aggressive all-terrain Falcon Wild Peak tires. The front bumper is equally aggressive and off-road ready, and there is a standard roof rack to hold your heavy loads. Nissan, however, won't just concentrate on the exterior but also the interior of the 2026 Nissan Rogue. We expect its interior to feature spacious, ergonomic seats with water-repellent leatherette upholstery. We also expect the seats to come heated, especially the front options. Moreover, we expect Nissan to include a newer off-road view camera system capable of working at a top speed of 12 miles per hour to assist the driver in avoiding parky obstacles. Plus, we expect the 2026 Nissan Drag to utilize Nissan's latest ProPilot Assist 2.1 driver assistance suit, which has the most advanced safety systems. There you have it. Those are the five new models that Nissan plans to unleash for 2026. Until then, here is another interesting video on Subaru 5 new 2026 models that you'll love watching. See you there.